Hey guys, first of all, I hope you all had a happy New Year's. Now, every New Year's Eve, my friend Kyle has a New Year's Eve party at his house where he more or less turns his garage into almost like a small venue in a way, and he has bands that he knows play there, including his band, The Filth Bombs. And every year I take video of the bands that play there and I edit a long video showcasing the bands that play at my friend Kyle's New Year's Eve party. And this year was no exception. So yeah, here's the video. And if you like the music that you hear in this video, I'll leave links in the description below to where you could check out more music from the bands that appear in this video. So without further ado, here is is my friend Kyle's New Year's Eve party. Enjoy. It's recording. Tell me when. Tell me when. when? I, I don't see anything. Well, what is this fancy picture device? Uh, um, did you get the, You got this from a canyon? Yeah. I don't understand. Is this like some kind of picture box? Yeah, I think so. I don't get it. New Year's is confusing. So let me ask you guys, New Year's Eve party, how are we all doing out there tonight? Yeah, that was, that was fucking terrible. I said, how are you guys doing tonight? I'm doing all right. Thank you. Everybody ready to see the Phil Bells play tonight? Come over here. I'm fucking ready. This is all we wrote together collectively. Let's have a grand map myself. Uh, it's called uh, Peace Within.
This next one we're gonna do. Oh, oh, Matt. Matt, Matt, Matt messed it up for everybody. Matt, you, you, are, you are so dumb. I don't like you. Right, this song is called Nightmares. Is it Nightmares or Nightmares? It is plural. <laughs>
Together collectively. Ever, Second to last, so that, that is the one before. Is the last. Oh, correct. <laughs> yes. Okay, I got it. That is what penultimate means. Okay, got it. All right. <laughs> this is called Blackbeard's Revenge. Who put the most these, remember? This year. Oh, I love this song. <laughs> Bobby loves this song. So if you don't love it, blame Bobby. <laughs>
Alrighty. So this is our fun, uh, this is our finale. Vinny says to Sabbath. In the history of us playing uh, Kyle's New Year's party, this has been a crowd favorite. You are highly recommended to sing along if you know the Woods. Does anyone here like the band, a little band called Black Sabbath? Besides me, obviously I'm wearing a shirt. Never hide of them. Never hide of them. Oh. You're about to.
Kyle. That's bad. Kyle. Matt knew that it ended and you didn't know it yeah, ended. Yeah, I totally. Wait, I, I knew it ended straight up. Yo, Kyle. <laughs> I speak for everybody in this room when I think you should play one of your old classics, Arnold Palmer versus the Coke Machine. Someone stole my bike! Someone stole my bike! Someone stole my bike! Let's stop it! Someone stole my bike! I love what a following that song is created. Yeah. I know I'm the first one. That's what I'm talking about!
most extremist the Ramones. <laughs> we played a show with one of them. Not a real one, no. So did Vinny. He did it better. He played with them at what? The Knitting Factory? And you wish CJ kissed you and you yeah, CJ Ramon knows me as the dirty hot dog Ramon guy. Yeah. Hey, I was in that hot dog eating contest, too. <laughs> he was jealous, so I kissed him after, so he could have CJ Ramon's oh. bath germs. I was doing the I'm hot so dog eating contest at Howie's. So sweet. Fat Howie's contest. Oh, I remember that. And I grabbed the hot dog. I don't, I don't know if it works like that, but all right. No, he, he got right there his next to me. He thought it was a gross as shit. Oh, well. But I was a badass. I fucking hammered through it. Yeah. CJ Ramon's next to me as I'm eating hot dogs, and he's chewing my name next to me.
Oh, Kyle. Oh, Kyle. All right. Oh, I always knew you guys would be famous. No, we're not no, famous we're anymore. We used, we used to be. We used to play at bowling alleys. We used to play at bowling alleys. <laughs> in Revolution, we had pay a thousand dollars to play at. I remember those bowling alleys. And now we just play it at my garage for a bunch of drunk people. Speaking of drunk people, where, what hole or crevice did Matt Riley stuff himself in? So now we're gonna try to do a cover that Matt can actually play. Up in here, y'all gonna make me. Oh, 
the way that Brentwood works is that if you want something, you steal it and you paint it black. So this is about Joe losing something and painting it black. It's not oh, wait, I, I ran out of black spray paint. They put, they put my face up on the bulletin board at Home Depot. Like, Woo! Okay. Come on, What the fuck my bike?
Go be gay somewhere else. I have never mind. I don't Structured it is. Now, I don't. Let me think about something. Went to the store to buy some milk, and I went to the store to buy some groceries. Then I went outside of the store after buying some groceries and I looked for my bike which I rode there on and it was gone. This song oh was you also, this song was done by a very, very popular band. Nirvana? The bombs. Here's the chorus again, because that's how the song goes. <laughs> Motherfucker! Motherfucker! Motherfucker!